Welcome. In the previous video, I talked about setting up OpenVPN on an Asus router and connecting to it on a Mac. And in this video, I'm going to be doing the same thing, but I'm going to connect to it with an iPad. And this will work with an, any iOS device. It'll work with the iPhone or the iPad. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to splice in part of the video of the last video I made on how to set this up on the Asus router. And then we'll meet back up and I'll finish the configuration on the iPad. So before we get the VPN set up, you may want to go to WAN on the left here and then go to DDNS, and then we'll hit Enable DDNS Client. And here you can choose a DDNS service, so you can just use ASUS. And with ASUS, you type in your host name you want to use, .asuscom.com, and then it will check the system and see if that's available. And that will set up uh, dynamic DNS, so if, you're, if you have a DHCP on your WAN address, if that changes, um, this will update, so you always have an address. And the VPN service on the ASUS router will utilize that. If you have a static IP, this isn't exactly necessary. And also, if you have an IP that's dynamic, but it never really changes, like say if you're setting this up before you go on vacation, um, it, it may just work um, using the same IP. So that's one thing you may want to do is set up this dynamic DNS, and you just hit yes here, enter your name, and hit apply. And then next, you want to go to the VPN here. And you have two choices here. You have, um, we're on VPN server, and then you have PPTP and then Open v VPN. So we want to click on Open VPN. And here you want to click on, uh, I already have it on here. And then VPN details, we just have general. And then you can do RSA encryption, you can do a 1024 by 2048. So you can get all this set up and then you can try some of these different settings or play with it a little bit. This is just the basic setup. And then client will use VPN to access and you could say local network only or internet and local network. So if you want to connect back to your house so you can connect to your server, local network only might work. But if you're on an untrusted network, like in a hotel, you may want to click this internet and local network. That way all of your traffic gets routed through your home internet account. So. Um, next, we want to go down here and we need to add an account. So I'll just say uh, demo, and then my password, I'll just say demo pass. And I'm going to be deleting this obviously after this video. So I'll add that on here. And then I'll hit apply. And as far as I know, this doesn't reset the whole router. Okay, so where we left off, we were on the ASUS configuration page. So I'm on that on my uh, iPad right now, and it's all set up. And then what I want to do is I want to go to the App Store and download the OpenVPN client. Okay, so I'm in the App Store. You want to search for OpenVPN, and you want to open the OpenVPN Connect. So I've already downloaded it, so I have this little icon. Otherwise, you're going to hit Get, and this is a free download. Okay, so that's downloaded, we can open it. Okay, we're gonna leave this as is. We're gonna go back to our Safari web page. So if you read the instructions on this, they give a couple different ways to open the OVPN file. And one is to use iTunes to get it on your iPad. The other one is to email it. And I don't like either of those. I like to just open up this website in Safari and then I'll click export next to export open VPN configuration file. I'll just hit that and it opens up this web page and it says client.ovpn, and then there's an option down here to open it in OpenVPN. So I'll hit that, and it opens it up in OpenVPN. I'll hit Agree, and it'll ask us if we want to add it. So I'll hit Add. It'll ask for the username, so I'll type that in. It says Save Password. So I'll put the password in down here. And then I'll hit Add in the upper right. And it says OpenVPN would like to add VPN configurations. I'll hit allow. I'll use Touch ID to authenticate. And now we have our OVPN profile here. And we have a little on off button next to our VPN. So I'll tap that. It says allow OpenVPN to enable VPN connection. I'll hit yes. And here we have the VPN connection all set up. So it's running right now. So I'm doing this on the network with the VPN, and this is a good way to test it. As I mentioned in my previous video, 
what you want to do is uh, take this somewhere off-site to test it to make sure it's working too. So you can go to a library, a restaurant, mall, something like that, see that it connects up and make sure it's working properly before you say go on a trip and want to use this to connect back to your network. So the VPN is connected. We can go back to our settings and we can see the connection there too. So here we see we have PC and open VPN and it says status connected. So I'll hit that and I'll disconnect from it and then I can hit it again and it will connect right back up. So that's pretty fast. So that's how to connect up an ASUS router, open VPN to an iPad or iPhone device. If you have any questions about this, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.